What's Cat doing? Hips, hips, wiggle your fists. Hips, hips, wiggle your fists. Eeps, eeps, wiggle our feet. There you go, you're getting it. <laughs> that from the Sky Store? Uh huh. What is it? It's the world's most powerful portable juicer for juicing on the go. You're so screwed up. No, it's really cool. Look at. You juiced my pizza. Why chew what you can drink? Thanks for petting my head, bum. <laughs> can I tell you a secret? Sure. my punch. You think Kat's trying to make Robbie jealous? Wow! Sinjin, you're such a good dancer! So much better than Robbie. Oh! Oh, Kat, I'm so sorry. Did you see that? I'll drink it. Before I take you in there, I should warn you. About? My grandmother. She can be critical. That's OK. I take criticism really well. No, you don't. What's that supposed to mean? Just that you don't take criticism very well. Why don't you just kick me in the face? Right, I'm sorry. I take it back. OK. Hi. Hey, guys. We have a song. For you. Mr. Beck. Your life's going swell. Now, here's some news. That's not so fun to tell. Oh. oh. Now, Andre, would like to thank you for the use of your car. But something icky happened, and it's kind of bizarre. His grandmother peed in a clear plastic cup. Andre put it in your car, then he started it up. Now comes the bad part. <laughs> he was on his way to the doctor and he took a sharp turn. The cup fell over and spilled all the urine. <laughs> 64 plus 9 equals 73. But please don't feel bad now that your car smells like pee. Because <laughs> you're still good looking. Wow, you turned it off. You've been talking into a offy talking. Somebody just get me a sandwich! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my God, the alarm! What I want to know is what part of the chicken do the nuggets come from? <laughs> 
can someone tell me this, please? I mean, where's the wacky farm that raises nugget chickens? Hilarious observations. Please, come in. And don't get me started on airplane food. I noticed that you were a stand-up comedian. Where's the beef? I am a police officer. Would you like to join me in a handful of raisin bread? What's the deal with raisin bread? Is it raisins? Is it bread? I want to know. Ooh. What? What? I just wanted to see if you'd come back if I honk the horn. <laughs> Restrain her. Have you ever wondered what it's like to be a blonde? No. <laughs> I've wondered that. I've also wondered why lemonade is a drink and first aid is for the injured. <laughs> like, what if a thirsty person gets injured? Do you give them first aid first and then lemonade? Or lemonade first and then second aid? <laughs> lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, here I am. How's everyone doing today? Anyone want to talk about what I'm wearing? <laughs> it's a... a jelly hoochoo! A jelly Jewish who what? A jelly hoochoo! They're pajamas, they're jeans, they're leggings. It's a hoodie, it's a poncho. The pajelly hoochoo! I think I've seen the pajelly hoochoo advertised on TV. Yeah. I got the commercial right here. Oh, <laughs> cool. Hmm. Let's see. Do your clothes make you feel uncomfortable? Have you ever thought to yourself, man, I wish I could wear something comfortable that'll make me feel normal and popular? That'll never happen. Shut up! What the? It's the Pajelli Hoocho. They're pajamas, they're jeans, they're leggings. It's a hoodie, it's a poncho. It's the Pajelli Hoocho! Is that a Pajelli Hoocho? It sure is. <gasps> the Pajelli Hoocho! <laughs> and when I went online to pajellihoocho.com, they said I could have free shipping if I bought a... a gross. Cat, that's 144. You bought 144 Pajelli Hoochos? Free shipping! Tell him you love him before you lose him! But I'm afraid to tell him. Look, it's been a really, really long time since I've seen you be happy. But ever since you and Keith... How's your audition going? I'm, I'm in the middle of it. That's so exciting! I'm sorry, who is... Uh, she's my friend, Kat. <laughs> you brought a superhero? I bet your left arm is 34 inches long. It is. Get out, cat. Whoosh. Hi. <laughs> Look at the new costume I made. Can you guess who I am? No. You're uh, Little Boy Pooh. Little Bo Peep. All right, can I just tell you guys how much I'm loving my new costume design class? Oh. And my teacher says I have a gift for knowing people's exact measurements. Hey, people, please. I'm not with him. Hey, Rob, you want me to tell you what size your pants are? I already know. They're a size four. <laughs> size four? That's how they measure girls' pants. Cat, maybe you want to back off that bibble gum. Don't tell me what to do! <laughs> Andre, you were at the restaurant with Tori. What's your take on what happened? Well, when the server brought her salad, Tori didn't like it. And you know, words were said, tables were flipped, and a great man who walked on the moon got ravioli in his pants. But that's not fair. How's the truth not fair? Wait. You don't think I'm obnoxious and awful, do you? Well, I just didn't think it was as nice as, but that was just fine. 
You've got to take that gum out of your mouth. Bye. Uh, you're the one oh, cat, no. who said, what are you doing? I wanted to lick the laser beam with my tongue. Why? Well... You want to know what flavor it is, don't you? Guess who? Um... <laughs> is it Beck? <laughs> what? I'm sitting right next to you. I don't... Oh, yeah. Hey, Beck. <laughs> She's feeling my face. Uh, no, no, it's me. But why does me eating butch peas help? Because it makes you miserable which makes me slightly less miserable. Your logic is flawless. Yeah, they're trying to get the picture down now. And that's tomorrow? Got it. Thanks, Mr. Ferber. Well? My dad's friend said that if we can get the picture of you off pair maps... Almost done. They'll take a new picture of Hollywood Arts next time the satellite goes over the school. OK, and when is that? Tomorrow afternoon at 4.14 p.m. Okay, great. So the plants can't. <laughs> no shoving bush peas in your pockets. I just sat down and said hi. Hi. If you're just gonna sit there and tweet stupid, pointless tweets, then please go sit somewhere else. Tori is being mean to me. Hashtag cramps. How could you? I mean, really, how could you? What did Kat do? She tweeted, big news, Robbie Shapiro has pimples. <laughs> what are pimples? Butt pimples. <laughs> pimples on one's bottom, which I do not have. I know. Then why'd you tweet that? Because I ran out of real stuff to tweet. And anyway, people like reading weird stuff about other people. Okay, so she tweeted that you have pimples. Nobody's going to believe her. Hey, Robbie. I have a doctor that can get rid of your pimples. <laughs> Dang it! Look, it's not my fault. Tori's the one who started this godforsaken followers war. Yeah, Kat, you're right. Hey, Tori, Tori. 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 Are you in? Who cracked that safe? Talk! Cat! <laughs> Cat! You have the next line. No, the bird does. No, no, we put the bird's line in later. And cut! Will Christmas be? Yeah, sure. Wait, who made it? My brother. Mm-mm, nope, no thank you. Why not? Because last month I ate his Thanksgiving sausage and I'm still a mess. Ho, ho to the ho. What's up? Ho! So, Mr. Music Man, close your eyes and get ready for the best Secret Cat Sad Valentine! Calling Cat Valentine! I'm Cat Valentine! Who's calling? <laughs> Your secret Santa! Oh my god, yay! <laughs> and your Christmas present is. Your very own cotton candy machine! Whoa. <laughs> That's right, this man, Larry Stein, will follow you around all week and give you all the cotton candy you want. <laughs> Watch. Oh, he's funny. <laughs> <laughs> it makes pretend snow. Ah, uh, see that. It's all over my tostada. And my pizza. Well, do not eat it. Why? Because it says the fake snow is toxic and can cause abdominal bleeding. <laughs> You said you'd be Robbie's magic assistant, right? Have you seen Moose? OK, I hear me talking. How come you don't? <gasps> Here he comes. Pretend like we're talking about something. We are talking about something, you crazy redhead. Hey, Kat. Oh, Moose, hi. Who are those flowers for? 
You. <gasps> Flowers for me? Yeah, I, I got your text that said, Hi, Moose, it's Kat. Please bring flowers to me at Hollywood Arts immediately. Oh, you're such a sweetie. Come on, let's go show Tori and Jade the flowers you brought me, and not them. <laughs> oh, oh Tofu, are you all right? Did she hurt you? She tried to, didn't she? <sighs> it's awful hot in here. I better open a window. I told no one. I told people not to look. Well, then it had to have been Robbie, because... <laughs> what do you mean you told people not to look? I tweeted it on the slap. You... <laughs> what did you tweet? Just please do not go on Paramaps and look up Hollywood Arts. If you do, do not zoom in on Jade. P.S. She's not picking her nose. I made it super clear. <laughs> What? Just run. Run fast and far. Hey, Kat. Cool outfit. Thanks. What you got there? It's my sack of bibbles. It's really heavy, so I put it in a wagon. And you needed to bring all of it to school? I can't help it. It's so good. Can't believe Mason bought you this much. This isn't even the sack he got me. What? I finished that one. I went back and bought two more sacks. I think I might have a bibble problem. Well, it is pretty good stuff. Don't touch it! My bibble. You guys, you guys, have either of you seen Jade? Uh-uh. No. Why, well, what's up with Jade? She's trying to kill me. Any reason? Well, we were hanging out last night, and she asked me to do her eyebrows. Do what to him? Make them look neater and nicer. Girls do that. We groom each other like monkeys. So why is Jade trying to kill you? Well... Where is she? Stop her! What was that about? Why are you so mad at Kat? Don't say a word. My sister's butterfly, is he still in your ear? Well, he was just a second ago. <laughs> yeah. Did you find the way to get him out yet? No, and until then, he still needs to be fed. But he's in my ear. No, but still have to make sure he eats properly. That's a banana. May I please? I guess. Lunchtime! <gasps> What I did was terrible and awful and immature, and you have every right to be furious with me. I swear, Kat, if I were you, I'd just punch me right in the face. Now! Kat! What? You just punched me in the face! You said to. I know, but that's just something people say. Ow! Does it hurt? A lot. I think my nose may be broken. Well, now I feel all bad. Come on. Don't you think we should just wait one more minute? Who's out here? Be gone, ghost of Mona Patterson. Go to the light. Kat, I'm almost sure she's not dead. Don't poke that. Why did you?
did you think that she was dead? I read it online. It said Mona Patterson joins the dead. That's a new TV show, you dip. It was a story about me being cast in a show called The Dead. I played David Schwimmer's wife. Well, nice to meet you. I'm Kat. Good. I have something nice for cats. <gasps> Just wait a second. This girl made us drive two hours through the rain in a topless convertible just because she loves you and your work. So would it kill you just to be a little bit nice and maybe... Give me all your threes. Go, Flush. It's fish. Well, I'll be on board. I don't want to play anymore. All right, well, do you want to play something else? Like what? Arr! No! <laughs> Bobby, you can just go home. I'll be fine here. No. I'm not going to leave you in this little tiny room by yourself with rats in the ceiling. Cat, grab your stuff. We're going for a ride. To where? To your grandmother's apartment. But I told you, she moved to Italy. No, I called your parents. Your Nona moved to Venice. Right. That's in Italy. I looked it up. Venice, California. It's 12 miles from here. Well, that explains why I saw her at the mall last weekend. You think she'd let me move in with her in Venice of America? Yes. Your parents talked to Nona, and she'd love to have you come live with her. Really? Well, I'll just live there, then. Don't you just love how dogs hang their head out the window and lick the wind? What? <laughs> <Whoops. laughs> Pull your head back in the car before I roll up the window and cut it off. My head's back in the car. Over here into the light. Okay. <laughs> uh, what is this for? Oh, that's glue. Yeah, but why is it with your makeup supplies? What's the problem? This is grizzly glue. It's like an industrial cement. Heh. <laughs> Cat, tell me you didn't use this on Tori's face. Uh. For industrial use only, caution, avoid contact with skin care. I'm sorry. Why didn't you use derma glue? I ran out, so I got that out of my dad's toolbox. Come out. Are you insane? Will it come off? I don't know. Why didn't you read the label? Because I got distracted by the picture of the cute grizzly bear. I mean, look at him. He's like a fuzzy cat. Light. Hey! I'm sorry. I'm coming in now. Hi, Mrs. Toy's mom. Hello, cat. Why'd you get a dog chew toy cell phone? To help me get through the week. I mean, I know it's not like having a real phone, but at least I can pretend. But what's the point? This is all I've got! <laughs> but it's not even... Can I hold it? Oh, you girls are pathetic. When I was your age, we didn't even have cell phones. Yeah, but you had stuff that we don't have. Yeah, like dinosaurs and Moses. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Ew, Jade, your outfit's all dirty. Oh, no, no, I'll never win the prison beauty pageant. Wait, they have that? Where have you been? I joined the prison gang. What do you mean? Well, this group of really mean, tough prison ladies said I'm cute and funny, so they invited me to join their prison gang. What? And you said yes? Uh-huh. I told the gang ladies I'm going to make us all special T-shirts. <laughs> um. I think you look nice with no eyebrows. Jade, I just want to say, I really appreciate you having lunch with us. And thank you, Andre and Beck, for handcuffing Jade to the table. No problem. I still don't get how this happened. Well, Jade asked me to make her eyebrows look nice, so I tried to wax them, but when I took the wax strips off, there was, um, 
a problem. My eyebrows are gone! No, they're not! I told you, they're right here! <laughs> no offense, Mr. Butterfly, but I sure wish you'd die. Hey, looky, looky what I got! No, I don't want to see that thing again. Put it away! No, this is a butterfly motel. What's it for? Butterflies. It's filled with everything they like. Dirt, plants, and rotting fruits. OK, so? Well, I figure if you stick your head in here, the butterfly will crawl out of your ear and then frolic about. You want me to put my head in there with the dirt and the rotting fruit? It might make the butterfly come out of your ear. Whoa! Is her head in a butterfly motel? Yes! Me next. What if we write about a giraffe who learns to love? A giraffe? That's, that's not good. No. Let's just stick with the kid in the closet. Right. So I was thinking maybe he comes home from school looking for something, and he goes into his closet, and there's, like, a small secret door in the back of... <laughs> Cat, what are you doing? I clicked on Rainbow. <gasps> Will you please stop that? We gotta do this project. Sorry. Man, how long have we been sitting here like this? 12 minutes. <laughs> ah, I can't handle being trapped like this. We're like animals. Ooh, can I be a hippopotamus? <laughs> what? It's friends for hippopotamus. I know an old man named Parnell. His wife says things to him like, Hey, Parnell, you want to eat some pancakes on a rocket ship? Nobody ever knows what you're talking about. <laughs> you have man breath. Bag of rags? I got them on tapas. 75% off. They're just rags? In a bag? <laughs> I see that. OK. <laughs> so Robbie drove you to school this morning? Oh, yes, but never again. I've got to find someone else to drive me. Well, I bet my brother would drive you, if you don't mind screaming. <laughs> Wait, you guys scream at each other? No. Sometimes he just screams. <laughs> like at trees. And buses. Thanks, but I'll find someone else. Why don't you just get a driver's license like a normal teenage girl? Bag of rags. You know my problem with these sunflower seeds? So, first you're gonna steal my seeds, and now you're gonna criticize? Yes. It's too much trouble to open them. I'll open them. Um, Kat? What? Baby, nobody wants to eat sunflower seeds that have been tap danced on the floor. You can't tell anybody about this. Neither can you. How great is this bibble? It's so great! What? Uh, you guys looking at the new Paramaps app? Yeah, now you can zoom in from any angle. Oh, my gosh, that's where we eat lunch. Yeah, the Paramount satellite must have taken the shot a few months ago from space. Hi. Cat, we're inside. Hey, is that us? Oh, my gosh, that is us. Oh, yeah, I'm wearing my red boots. Uh, can you zoom in tighter on Jade? I think. Oh, zoom, a zoom, zoom. Um. <sighs> no. Okay, no, I, I, I'm not. Hey, 
sucking your nose? Cat! Um, and then I'm gonna do some juggling, and then I'm gonna sing a song from my favorite musical. Baby, you got 90 seconds. But it's a five-minute audition. Action! <laughs> Just marry me. But I'm supposed to marry somebody else. You know you don't want to be with him. I don't know what I want anymore. I think you do know. Why do you always have to complicate my life? I love you. Juggling! And her nose, everyone is gonna love you now. <laughs> Life on the street is a nail on the head, it's better than fixing the roof, but instead, the crowd will back and the crowd will be singing along. Oh, what a girl, what a nice face, this is my song. And the biggest bang with the most to sing. If you're the hand on the diamond ring, by the way, I'm here for the song and the dance. <laughs> so give me one to sweat, I've already won. All I need is John Sweat Chance. <laughs> Stick your stupid arm right in there. <laughs> Kill me with a rock. Uh oh. Yeah, it is raining. <laughs> hey, Kat, I think I brought an umbrella. Do you see it back there? No, not really. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay. All right, you caught me. What? I want to show you what I got. Sure. Okay, now walk towards me. Closer. Closer! Step away! You are too close to this person. The police are on their way. I didn't do anything. Uh, would you turn that off? Move back! It's the world's best alarm necklace. The world's brightest keychain. Yeah, ow. Okay. All right, that's bright. You can turn that off now. <laughs> no. 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 But I want him to see me. Please. I, 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 I can't. I can? Can? You can. I can, I can. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just uh, open the box a teeny bit. Just peek your head on in there. And... <gasps> oh, oh, no! Oh, no, 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 Come on, fly. Come back, no, come back. Come oh, here. Okay, no, come here, come, come here. here. Papa's over here, Papa's oh, over God. here. Oh, jeez. Oh. What are you doing? Come here. Oh. Quick. Oh, man. Ah. I lost him. Where'd he go? I think I found him. Where, where is he? I think he's in my ear. In your ear? Well, maybe he's not. I don't feel it anymore. <laughs> Wait, I think it's gone. Are you sure? I don't feel it anymore. <laughs> Dang it, Tori, I only want to answer squat-related questions. Is it my turn to squat? No! Come on, cat. You can take my place. Okay. Yay, we're squat buddies. All right. So far, we have nothing. So it'd be great if we could do a little writing together, okay? Look, I'm in a kaleidoscope. Whoa, oh, how does she do that? You just click effects in the lower left. This is not a time for effects. Look at me. You guys are giving me a headache. Andre! Ooh, I'm getting dizzy. Look at me. I'm spinning around. <laughs> what effect is that? Uh, it's spin clockwise. Why tell her that? Whoa. <laughs> We're not making progress. Here I go. Andre, I need you to focus Whoa. and keep your eyes open. I'm spinning. I can't focus on anything. <laughs> it's like a spaceship. I'm princess rotation. Oh. You guys. We have a project to work on.
God, I'm not gonna sit here and watch you guys spin clockwise. Hey, you heard the lady. Ready? Get it clockwise! Oh, reverse! We're reversed now! That, that, that's not what I meant! Look at me going back in time! When did I become the mature one? Well, if it's gonna be on national, give me my keys back. Where's my house key? I'll take her to the nurse. I swallowed it. We'll see it again. <laughs> it says, write a single scene script between seven and 10 pages. The scene must involve a mystery. Ooh. Use at least three characters and have a surprise plot twist. Got it. We can do that. Ideas? Hey, you guys want to hear a cute joke? A joke? Yeah, listen. OK. What did the young shrimp say when his mom asked him why he wouldn't share any of his toys? What? Sorry, I'm a little shellfish. <laughs> Get it? Because shrimp are very self-centered. I, I think the joke is that shellfish sounds like selfish. Oh my god, that's even funnier! <laughs> okay, back to the script. You wanna ask her? Sure. What's in the box, cat? C batteries. C batteries. <laughs> and you all get some. C batteries for Andre. C batteries for Beck, and C batteries for Robbie. <laughs> you wanna ask him? Okay. Cat, why do you have a giant box of C batteries? Cause I tapped it. Come on, Rob, it's not so bad. Okay, okay big deal, you lost a handbone competition. It's over, and it's not like the whole world saw it. Uh-huh. It's all over the internet. How'd it get on the internet? I, I might have uploaded it. Why do you guys need slippers? Grab the cat. Yep. <laughs> Yay, I'm a kite. Enjoy. Now you can tap till your feet fall off. <laughs> Sad little one. I think your head looks great like that. Of course you do. <laughs> God, she chewed through her leash. I'm free. Okay, good. Um, how do I spell evil? Use four I's and three L's. Got it. Okay, um, now why don't we say the mom walks into the closet to find her son's face being eaten by... Look! <laughs> now I'm a Terry Pie! <laughs> I'm Pie Girl! But <laughs> don't bite off my nose! <laughs> Cat, we have a 10-page script due tomorrow morning, and we're on page three, and you're not helping at all! Now, will you please stop acting like a child? There she goes. Okay, look, I, I didn't mean to yell at you. Please don't cry. I'm just frustrated because... Hello. Ah! Hey, hey, hey. You don't have to keep running away from me. I already asked Gabriella to be my date to the cow wow. Gabriella? Mm-hmm. Well, what'd she say? She said, see. Si. That means yes. I know. I looked it up. <laughs> <laughs> well, yay. You got yourself a pretty girl to take to the cow well. Yeah. Well, I just wanted to let you know you don't have to run away from me anymore. <laughs> Thanks, Robbie. See you in class. Okay. Ah! 